What is up everyone? Gunplug Collection here and welcome to another episode of GBGW. Now before I begin with today's episode, I have a question for you guys. Do you guys prefer the current way that the video is set up where the gameplay is actually in the center of the screen or would you rather have it in like a portrait mode where you can view it um, on your phone as if you were playing? Um, let me know in the comments down below if you know if you guys prefer portrait mode over um, landscape mode. But it, anyways, let's go ahead and get on with it. So I did complete the achievements today, actually, and I act, I don't even know how many uh, hardware trips I used, but. Uh, I managed to get myself to the max level once again, 150. I am kind of late in regards to that, um, but I am really happy to be at 150 now. Um, all we need to do is just wait for pretty much another level cap. And then of course our, um, I guess our team, what is it, the cost? They need to raise that so that we can have an entire team of three. Um, basically all tier 5 parts equipped but other than that the only thing I have for today is pretty much some poles now let's go ahead and jump into it and go into event capsules real quick now we have 60 um, capsule medals so that means 6 times 10 rolls so let's go ahead and get on with it so yes all right and touch Alrighty, try again. Yes. Alrighty, and touch. Try again. Yes. And touch. Try again. Yes. Still no buster arms. That's the only thing I need. And touch. Alright. Am I going to get the Buster Arms? I doubt it. And touch. Yeah, we are not getting the Buster Arms. Looks like I'm going to have to wait until the next one. Alright, and touch. Alright, so that was the last of my standard capsules here. Premium wise, we can only roll once. So let's see what we get. Yes. Hopefully it's another F91 part that I actually don't have. I don't want duplicates. That's that's pretty much it. And touch. Once again, the Buster Gundam legs. Now, I don't know how many times I've gotten the Buster Gundam legs. And it's kind of like, come on. Give me, give me something else other than legs. All right. Akatsuki-wise, let's go and draw. We have three of them. Hopefully we don't get duplicates, but knowing my luck, I'm definitely going to get duplicates of the Akatsuki. All right, let's go. Yes. Plus the Akatsuki is actually a multiplier part for the next upcoming event, which is coming out tonight. So, all right, and touch. Okay, the head. So that literally leaves me with the arms and the beam saber to be honest try again yes will i get lucky and actually get the arms to get the color scheme we'll find out and touch okay another chest here's our last one yes i have a feeling this is gonna be a duplicate and touch okay i'll take him neo Let's see what he is. He's fairly balanced. Uh, he's okay, to be honest. But that means I'm still two parts away from completing the Akatsuki. Uh, let's go ahead and jump home. And I'll go ahead and show you guys uh, collection. And this is something that's been irritating me a lot. And let me go ahead and pull it up real quick. So, 
As you can see, the Castratria, I'm just missing two parts. The arms, come on, and the legs. Unicorn, same thing, the arms. That That's just my luck here. I'm not sure what it is, like why I can't get that. F91 wise, well of course the uh, drop rate of the F91 is pretty bad. So I only have two parts, but I've gotten duplicates, I, if I'm correct. Um, but where is it? Where is it? Gonna see Destiny right here. Anyways, as you guys can see, the Akatsuki is only missing its arms and basically the Beam Saber. Like, the arms is the last thing I need in order to actually get the color scheme, and it, you know, I'm just not getting it. So, hopefully, the uh, Washi Akatsuki comes back um, sometime soon, probably, you know, in the next few events or something like that. If it, if it does come back, it'd be nice. If it doesn't, I'm kind of stuck with armless parts and not claiming this nice gold color scheme the Akatsuki has. <clears throat> but I mean, I guess in a sense I'm pretty much set for the next event, even though my multipliers aren't really going to be that great. Alrighty, so let's go ahead and jump in the shop real quick. Exchange. And I pretty much bought everything that I could except for the Gumbla parts now in a sense I don't I don't know I I, I guess I should have bought bought one more shield but I guess that's okay yeah that's pretty much it to be honest there isn't really anything else in regards to well the current event I mean there is still the the lucky bag number three right here so if you guys want you know a chance for the cubile the unicorn or the high new you know go ahead and grab it i actually don't recommend it because the drop late drop rates are still pretty bad but i mean you know i guess it is what it is um, but anyway, tonight, guys, is the new event. It will be live at 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Um, other than that, guys, that's pretty much it. So if you guys are, you know, having questions about, you know, if I should pull this or pull that, um, one thing I have to say is I recommend pulling Sokai over any event capsules. Um... Revival capsules are tempted, are, let me rephrase that, you will be tempted to pull for the revival capsules, um, and all I have to say is if the drop rates are not exactly like the Sokai Festival, you don't want to pull for the revivals. Um, but anyway, other than that, this has been another video for GBGW, make sure to give my videos a thumbs up. Comment in the videos. Let me know what you guys think and stuff like that. Um, don't forget, subscribe and hit that bell notification icon so that you guys are up to date with all the new videos I post. Other than that, guys, thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys in tomorrow's episode. Peace out.